Welcome back to the channel, guys. Garth Sloan here, your partnered content creator for Expansive Worlds. And we have a little bit of darkness left. It is 4.30 in the morning. That is one thing that's been tough, trying to find a server. It's going to be a little bit of a challenge for the king of the catch this week, as the bream is the fish that we are targeting, and it is a nighttime fish. And we don't have, a mu we don't have too much time to fish at night. There's very little nighttime. It's gonna make it a challenge for our Tackle Tuesday as well. But my setup is, uh, well, I'll just tell you, we're using a number seven hook and we're using Bloodworm because that is the biggest you can go. And so you are gonna catch some small green. There's a roach, there's a two pound roach and you'll catch two pound green. Let's look at the bream. Some of their baits that they like to bite on are blood worm, red worm, pearl barley. Well, the blood worm is their favorite and seven is as big as that goes. Now I'm gonna say bream can get up to about 20 pound because I have a goat here that was 12 pound. This is a reported diamond location for perch and bream. All right, let's see what we've got here. Give us a bream. Now you could switch to the pearl barley or one of the other baits if you just keep catching roach. That is always something that you can do. But after we catch this guy, whatever he is, we're gonna to go to probably my favorite spot on the map to fish. Another silver roach, which wouldn't break my heart if I caught a diamond roach while doing this because I still need one. All right, um, let's go to my favorite spot and that is Magic Pond. Now Bream also are bottom lurkers. They do nibble, so just throw it out there, drop it all the way to the bottom, listen for them to nibble. Kind of a relaxing way to fish actually if you wanna check messages on your phone, things like that. All right, what we got on here? Hopefully this is a bream. It's a little bigger as you see there. It's taking up a lot more space than what the roach did on my wheel here over in the bottom right. The roach just barely even registers. This should be a bream. Oh, it's a burbot, the silver burbot. Okay. And you know, that doesn't break my heart either. It's starting to turn daylight. That's what's gonna to be tough about this. Now technically it's gonna be daylight until, or dark until 6 p.m. So. What I'm probably gonna to have to do to be able to have enough footage to show you guys where to fish from, I'm gonna to have to drop in some of my streamed footage from earlier. I fished from here, just walked down here and caught a goad. Oh, of course. Uh oh. Oh, there's a gold bream, guys. And I can show you guys here. They're really bright there. Uh oh, what are we hooked into here, boys? Nice, 9.65 pound bream. That's actually, that is almost gold because that 10 pounder I caught earlier. Good. Now we caught me and Alpine in this area here where the burning ship is. We caught several bream there, but there's not been a diamond bream reported caught there, but there has been here and here off these rocks. Silver brain. So 
there, there, up here. This waterfall area also. And this magic pond. So we've got one, two, three, four, five known locations where diamonds have been caught. I don't have that labeled bream, but that waterfall area there, you can catch diamond bream in pipe there. I don't have this labeled either. All right, we got something else here. We're gonna change spots, try to hit another spot before it turns dark. The magic pond is definitely one of the places. This is probably gonna be a roach. Uh, and again, use pearl barley if you want. I really, you know, if I catch a diamond of something else, it's not gonna break my heart. There's a nice two pound roach. All right, here we go. Ooh, what could this be, I wonder? This is big, it's probably using. Oh, it is a bream, it's a 9.83 bream. That's a big, that's almost gold. That is almost another gold bream. I, this is my, this might be my favorite spot to fish for them. right here off this bank. I feel like I just, I catch less roach here and more bream. That's, and you only have to walk right there and it's a diamond reported spot. So this actually might be my favorite spot to fish for bream, all things considered. Knowing that it's possible to catch a diamond here, I've already caught a goad. That was almost a goad. This might be the spot. See what we got here. This, if this is a bream, this is another decent sized bream, I would say. Another silver bream. Yeah, definitely, definitely um, a spot that I would consider the best. If you want to start eliminating some of the smaller bream when they start biting a lot is you can drop to a six hook, five hook, put the red worm on, but then you're gonna catch some Xander too. As long as you don't mind that, no big deal. But you're nighttime fishing. So if you switch to pearl barley, then you're gonna end up, which Burbot, Burbot will also, Burbot will also buy this. So yeah, there's three bream in a row. There's a bronze. That's the downside of using that seven hook, but that's as big as the blood worm will let you go is seven hook. So. Now you can catch a lot of bream right here. You can catch some goads right here around the burning ship. Don't know if you can catch a diamond though. If anybody has caught a diamond there, please let me know in the comments. If you like the content, please let me know that by hitting that like button. Tell me in the comments if you have caught diamonds anywhere else besides these five reported spots and what baits you used, if you used anything different. Please catch some of our YouTube streams. Uh, they are scheduled Tuesday nights. I'm fishing with Scarecrow and Bro Bro and Big Rig and Tony and some of the others in the Tackle Tuesday competition. I normally go live at 8 p.m., uh, but definitely live by 9 p.m. for the competition. And... This week, it's going to be Bream, so hope to see you guys there. My other streams will be over on Twitch, usually 5 p.m. Eastern Time. My weekends are to be decided due to sports, golfing for me, uh, hunting. It's bow season right now, deer season. So now Sundays, I usually 8, 8 a.m. Eastern Time on Twitch. I'm on Sundays. But uh, through the week, 5 p.m. Eastern Time in the evenings, you all right, guys, follow us over on Twitch, Darth underscore Sloan. We will catch you in the next video.